all right guys splits here and we are gonna do a complete walkthrough of the playstation store um before we get started i did make a video on like the whole layout of the ps4 menu so if you guys want to check that out i'll put it on the screen and link below so let's get right into it so what basically the playstation store is where you buy games and look for deals so i'm gonna walk through all that stuff so let's go to the ps store so this is basically how it looks like uh, this is a layout so let's start off with the featured so the featured is always going to be different this is basically like the, an ad so we're not gonna so the ad right now is resident evil that always changes so and then the what's hot this is basically what's hot on every category i will get to every category so i'll skip that and then trending, this is basically what's what people are buying and what's selling on the PS store. So right now it's Resident Evil 7. And then we got a list of games, Infinite Warfare. It's not just games, but also movies. And yeah. Alright, so popular. These are this is, these are the most popular games right now. Um on the PS4. So let's look at the popular games now. These are always gonna change throughout time. So the number one game is Tomb Raider Def Definitive Edition. That's currently the number one game right now. And then you guys can see here just a bunch of them. So yeah, we also got popular add-ons, which is basically DLC. So which is downloadable content and then popular movies and then popular TV and then popular apps so that's the popular tab and then we get deals now there are always deals constant deals discounts on games so i recommend you guys um check the ps store daily because like you can save up to like 80 percent off or even more if you guys keep a lookout on that so currently like watchdogs like 33 percent off $60 game now a $40 game which is the full version so you guys can check that out so there's the deals just for you this is a recommended page basically so since I play like I don't know overwatch it's obviously gonna recommend me uh, loot boxes and then also recommends what your friends are playing right now so yeah and then Resident Evil like I said another ad greg the genie which i don't know what that is and then voodoo like i said these are gonna be ads so they're gonna constantly change so let's get to the main thing which are the games so the this is how the games are gonna look like so we got the spotlight which is currently like new on the front page we got featured and then brand new pre-orders must play popular so you get the you get the idea so if we go to new right now and we go to see what's currently coming out soon so this is basically all of them right now if it says pre-order then you can pre-order and then what it does is that it downloads the game so when the game officially comes out you can now play that on midnight so it that's pretty cool and convenient instead of going to like GameStop and just like you know waiting for midnight launch release that's what I always do so that's the games and then add-ons DLC so this is where you would get like like let's say 2k17 shout out to WWE like you get more superstars um, and then we get movies you can buy movies but I don't think anybody does that because everybody has Netflix and stuff and then TV shows basically you can get TV shows too and then apps so there are apps I'll show you the most downloaded so there is a YouTube app Netflix app you get you guys get the idea so there's just a ton of you can guys can scroll to them and then we got the free everything on this tab is free so there are free games you guys can see so these are the free games currently i got three on three freestyle which is actually pretty fun and there's just a ton of them 
So keep a lookout on that. And then we got extras. So this is basically where you would download your theme or like a background on your PS4 avatars. They just have a bunch, a bunch of avatars. They never stop. They always update them. And like I said, guys, we got PS4 themes. We got game soundtracks, which I don't usually uh, go to, but there's soundtracks and then share factory themes. All right, so now that we covered the games, let's cover what else they have. So they got PS Plus. I do have a video on what PS Plus is all about and what the features are. It's basically um, a subscriptions you have, you, you have to pay. So just watch that video and you guys will learn a lot more about PS Plus. And then we got PSVR. This is basically virtual reality. That's how it looks like. Personally, I do not own a PSVR. Um, I don't think I'll ever own one, but that's there specifically for VR gaming. PS Now. Now, this is basically um, playing your PS3 games on the PS4. It's a streaming service. So you pay it for one month, you get $10, and then for 12 months, it's $100. So I'll show you real quick how it looks like. All right, so right now it's loading up the menu for PS Now. So this is basically it. So these are all PS3 games that can stream on the PS4. We got Red Dead Redemption, Mortal Kombat. Um, so yeah, you guys can figure out if you want PS Now. Personally, uh, I do not have it. So yeah, whoops, I kind of went back too much. All right, so next we got PS View. Um, basically what this is, it's basically TV cable. Um, so you can watch like ESPN uh, and stuff like that. It's a, it's a subscription service, so you do have to pay. I do not own that. And then PS Music, basically Spotify. You can put your own music on the PS4. I do have a video on that. And plus you won't get any ads and you can play them while um, you play a game. So it plays in the background. And then PS Video, um, it's basically like you can buy movies, TV shows, or not TV show, just movies. Or yeah, TV shows and video. So, and then we got PS Originals. This is basically like Netflix, but exclu exclusively for PS Plus members. I don't usually, I don't ever use this, but it's there. Live events, if there's a live event, it will be here. And then Sony Rewards. Basically, it's a reward thing where... Uh, if you buy a game on the PS Store, it will actually reward you and give you points. And you can use those points to buy even more games. But you do need to apply. I'll put the site on the link down below if you guys want to apply there. And then my PS Now games. If I had PS Now, these are where this is where the games would be. And then we got Library. These are all the games that I bought on the PS Store. They will be kept in your library for you to keep so you can keep a track of them. And then my videos, like I said, they will be right here. And then redeem codes. If you have a PS Plus or a PSN card, this is where you would redeem it to buy games on the PS Store. And then finally, we got payment methods. If you guys have a credit card or PayPal account, you can link it. And you can start buying games so and lastly I forgot to mention these there is a search bar so if you want to search so if you want to search um, a certain game like let's say Call of Duty I think it's already there yeah Call of Duty will be there so this is how it looks like I already bought this but this is how the whole layout looks like gives you a subscription or not a subscription it gives you a description on what the game's about and it gives you more options and then finally we got the carts so if I put a game in a cart this is where it'd be and you can buy it it'll start downloading and the download 
uh, is based off your internet connection so the faster your internet is the faster it will download and you can start playing your game so that's basically the PlayStation Store I went through all of these I hope you guys have a better understanding personally for me I love the PS Store and also I, a quick tip check the PS Store daily because you never know what deals you'll find and what games are gonna come out soon so you can start pre-ordering so yeah guys that's basically it hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching